This video was recorded live on my Twitch channel. Check out all of my live streams down in the description below. Time to get our national B license. Five exams. I'm gonna be honest with you guys, there's no fluff here. This shit's easy. Before, not counting sport, because GT Sport is a spinoff and not an actual part of the actual series in my opinion. Um, these are the easiest exams of the main series. They're really goddamn easy. There's only five of them per license. So, exam number one for the National B license is literally full acceleration and braking. TC1 because we want to get a good launch. I, I, I legit um, broke way too early. However, the fact of the matter is we broke way too early. I started trail braking at the end there and we nearly got gold on the first attempt. By almost a whole second until I completely hit the brakes way too late at the end. Do I need to go any further? Yeah, the first restart of very few. These exams are not difficult at all. Hey, Ender. Welcome back, dude. Yeah, easy exam. No difficulty at all. So kind of like Gran Turismo 3, there's no next button. It's pissing. What, is it raining over there? Basic cornering. This next exam is at Apricot Hill, which makes a return to the series for the first time since GT4, obviously. And, uh, yeah, as you can see by the track map, you turn left. Minimize steering input. Easy gold. It's a typical German autumn. Well, it's autumn now, and it's super hot. We're in a heat wave again. I don't know why. It's pretty dumb if you ask me, but eh, what can you do? Yeah, the exams in this game aren't great at all. There's only one exam in, in particular that's difficult, and the only reason why is because... Oh, Mazda Demio Sport, by the way. Is because it's a gimmick. And that's something we'll get into later when the time is right, obviously. Just increasing input and steering, just to make sure that we get around the corner. Yeah, that's literally all we had to do. Yeah, it's not only not only the fact there's five exams, it's the objectives that are just Blah. They're just not hard. There's no difficulty to them. That, that, that That's the problem. And like I said, the only difficult one is just really gimmicky. It's just like, okay, um, you're going to give us a really heavy car and put us on a really tight and narrow circuit. Yes, tell, tell YouTube, fiends. They'll still find a way to say, wow, this is really hard. Uh, it took me like four attempts to get that gold. So, rolling start... I triggered your Google again. Um, rolling start... So that's why I put TCS to zero. Small lift. Small jab of the brakes. Through the national circuit of Silverstone. Another easy gold. Like, GT Sports exams are way easier than this, but... Yeah. Yeah, they are satisfying. Like, GT Sports are actual driving exams. Like, what is oversteer, what is understeer, those certain corners. Like, this is literally just... You get an S-turn, you only get one type of S-turn. You get start, accelerate, brake, you get one of those. You get a hairpin, you get one of those. So anyway, speaking of S-turns, Twin Ring Motegi. We're going to the S's of the road course. In a 2013 Ford Focus ST, which is a car I will definitely buy whenever I can. His nation's round 29 time. Oh my god. <laughs> the Elmer Salguero tribute. Bro, 
I won't even be alive to see that. You, you can't have a tribute unless... Nah, hell no. You guys want a tribute so that we guys can try to kill me, huh? Is that your guys' plot to, like, actually, like, wipe me off the face of this earth? Come on now. Claire got a tribute today? Oh, yeah, but I guess she's leaving. But see, the Ares and Senna tribute is there because Senna died. That's true. You don't have to be dead to have a tribute. Hmm. Still wonder. What? A, I just have to quit Twitch again? Well, I never quit Twitch to begin with. <laughs> I quit YouTube. <laughs> Yet. Nope, not one. Zero. So, Pojo RCZ 2010. Uh, OPS fuck car in the GR4 category in Gran Turismo Sport. Here? Meh. Yeah, who got... Pugiat. I'd rather have a Renault. So we're through London. That's really about it. It's London. I hit the restart button by accident, but that doesn't mean we have to do it again. We just had to exit. Yeah, I like London in the dry. I too like London in the dry. Yeah, we literally did one half of the track as as the as the final exam. So we've acquired our national B license, and now we can enter national B license events. I made it, Mama. So for getting our B license, we unlock the Gran Turismo Racing Kart Junior. Ooh, there's a lot of colors we can choose from. Uh. Do I want to go the Marvin the Gamer route? No. I associate this car with, like, arrive and drive carts, so... Purple. <laughs> Only because Ender said purple in, in all caps. We're going with purple. And then... The Alfa Romeo Mito. We already have a Rosso Corsa. We're not using this car at all, by the way. Like, I, I don't really care about it. We're getting it in black, just so we can have a black paint chip in case. You just never know if a car, like... If a car doesn't have a certain color that you like, and then you just need to buy... Yeah, mitosis. So, there we go. National B license acquired. As I mentioned before, coffee breaks will be done all together at once. And as a result, we've unlocked photo travel and seasonal events, which don't exist anymore. As you can see, we need to be logged into the server. And when we log into the server, it tells us, um... It, it tells us something like, um... You can't advance, advance past further because the servers are down or some shit. Did I piss on the moon yet? No, we haven't pissed on the moon yet. That's not till the A license, I believe. Let me get in my cart real quick, and then do one thing real quick before we begin B license events. Change the car number, because it's important we do that. Alright, there we go. We're, now we're going to start beginning B license events next time. <laughs> 